Hi guys, it's Kara. Today we're cooking with gas shrimp scampi style. My friend Carissa is in the kitchen with me today. So she's gonna be doing all the cooking. Super excited about that. So Carissa, tell us what you're making today. Today we're gonna make a classic shrimp scampi accompanied by an arugula salad with a citrus vinaigrette, garlic bread, and last but not least, our dessert is banoffees and cream. Okay, let's get cooking. What we'll do is put a little olive oil in here and we'll pour in our um, garlic next. So How much garlic are you using for this? It's about a bulb of garlic, a pretty large bulb. Okay. Yeah. You can never have too much garlic. I agree. There's no such thing. We love garlic around here, so. Okay. And then after that, we'll add in some white wine, some butter, some lemon juice. Um, I like to use a little chicken base. Mm -hmm. um, kind of kind of helps add in lots of good flavor. Shrimp scampi is very easy to make. Okay. Anyway, so while that kind of gets started, I'll go ahead and chop up some parsley. Um, we're gonna use that in this dish as well and also on our bread. So I'll go ahead and chop that up okay. and get that started and then we'll, we'll roll on. Okay, I'll tend to this over here. Okay, great. Always buy fresh if you can. Um, if you grow it in your garden, obviously use that. I'm using probably a handful of fresh parsley and just chop it up pretty fine. Um, presentation is just as important as flavor. Kara, how's the uh, garlic? It's looking good. It smells so good. It's good, good. starting to get a little brown, like a little golden brown. Okay, let's turn really the heat turn down it. just okay. a little bit. And uh, yeah, because you don't really want your garlic to get too brown because it adds not a very pretty color to your dish. Um, so what we'll do now is go ahead and add in our chicken base. Um, I'm also gonna go ahead and add in the lemon juice. You wanna try to do it so you don't get the seeds in the meal. Also, we wanna go ahead and add in this butter. Um, never use too much butter either. <laughs> butter and garlic. It's my kind of girl right here. <laughs> One more olive oil. So next we can go ahead and mix up our salad dressing while that's gonna hang out for a little bit. This is so good, you guys, so good. This is a really um, citrus salad dressing, fresh orange, um, it's very light, summery dressing, very easy to make. Um, I like easy, <laughs> anything easy is good with me. Um, so what we'll do is just mix in some um, canola, vegetable oil, then an orange, and then just juice. This is a pretty large orange, so you know if you can't find large ones, That's use so a good. couple small ones. I like to use a, um, a garlic infused olive oil. Um, it's it just adds a little bit of garlic flavor into this. Um, then I also add a white balsamic and that kind of sweetens it up just a little mm. bit more. Yeah, it's something I hadn't actually heard of until you introduced this dressing to me. So it's really tasty. It's super, it's a lot, a lot sweeter. Right, and a yeah, lot of times you, really need that, um, you need that flavor, but you don't need the color. Mm -hmm. So the white balsamic actually works really well for times like that. I believe our water is boiling. We're doing angel hair pasta. Let's go ahead and start our oven for our bread. Okay. Okay, and we're gonna crank up the heat on the scampi sauce. So we can go ahead and add in our shrimp. And these are kind of a medium yeah. shrimp, a medium to a medium large shrimp. They're all different mm -hmm. sizes. You can get whatever size you like for your sure. dish. And this is like two and a half to three pounds. You really need about three pounds for, you know, four to six people. Depends on how big your eaters are. All right. Um, while that's finishing up, I'm going to go ahead and slice our bread and get that ready for the okay. oven. Um, so I'm just going to cut a little bit of it here and we're going to um, toast it. Then I'm going to drizzle it with some of the um, garlic olive oil. 
We'll bake it, get it brown. These shrimpies are about done. Awesome. Let's cut that off. Okay. Yeah. And the bread is ready to go in now. Okay. Get a steam bath over here. That. Oh, wow. So good. It's so cute. It smells really so good, doesn't it? That garlic, the lemon, I can smell all these flavors, the mm. creamy butter and everything. Yes. And like you said, anybody can make this. It's such a simple thing. It is. And you think shrimp scampi and it sounds fancy and intimidating, but it's really not. You see, it's really not. Mm -mm. Now watch all this garlic. Actually, I'm gonna mm. pour that baby on. Mm -hmm. Don't leave anybody out. No. Oh my gosh. Absolutely not. Look at that garlic, it's just nice and chunky. Mm -hmm. Okay. Can't wait. And then, okay. we wanna sprinkle a little bit of our parsley on here, and then we may add a little bit to our dish as we serve it. That's a good idea. If you guys could smell this, <laughs> oh my gosh. Extra shrimp. Mm -hmm. Everybody loves shrimp. More blueberries. Yes. Please. All right. Cheers. Cheers. Dessert time. My favorite. Oh, we have three bananas here. I'm going to slice these up. Peel them for you. Thanks. I'm going to put the pan like on medium, medium high. Go ahead and get the butter in so it'll melt. Just like mm -hmm. bite size. We're just going to slice the bananas. Probably go ahead and take this over there. So again, butter is always a good thing here. This is going to, we're going to mix it with a sweetened condensed milk. And although it's a very simple recipe that most people have in their home, mm -hmm. it's a very good recipe. This we're just going to saute a little bit. Um, or in the sweetened condensed milk. And this, it's very important not to overcook this because it will start to separate. So we just want to pretty much just let it bubble for a minute mm -hmm. and then pour it right over the ice cream. Let's do it. All um, right. You lead the way. So I'm just gonna pour a little bit of this over and then I'll scoop out some of the bananas. Oh my gosh. Might be a little you guys won't believe this. It's so good. <laughs> easier with a ladle or something, but this will work. Good. Yeah, it's, it's very hot, so, so be very hot. careful. Mm. Mm -hmm. So good. Thank you. Thank you guys so much for cooking with us today. We're cooking with gas, shrimp scampi style, banoffees and cream. You can't go wrong. Enjoy, guys. Cheers. Oh yeah, it's looking good. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and turn my corner. Just a half turn. 